Hey everybody, it's Ramona. Welcome back. And I'm here today with my very first destination wax haul. Uh, I did haul this about a month ago. I, had, I got the package. Um, I've melted a little bit of it, but I was just kind of letting it set. Uh, I've heard some people say to let it cure for about a month. So that's about a month ago. Um, and so let's get into it. Um, the first one is Apple Whiskey Smash. And of course, everybody knows how pretty her wax is by now. It's beautiful. Uh, a little bit two-tone there. Uh, and this is, um, I love any apple scent. I really enjoy apple scents. This one is mostly apple with a little bit of like an underlying, like a warmth, which I, I, I guess that's the whiskey. It's not spicy. It's just like a kind of a deep note. That's not a very good description, but that's what it is. So, and uh, that's going to be a good one. And, you know, some people are seasonal melters. I kind of just melt what I feel like at the time. Sometimes, like on a rainy day or in the evening, I kind of want a, a deeper fall scent. And in the day, if it's a spring day, sunny day, I'll, I'll melt something a little bit, you know, lighter and brighter. So it just kind of goes on my feeling. I'm not, I just kind of go with the flow. Anyway, uh, this one is ginger ale, which I love ginger ale scents. And I love to drink ginger ale, Canada Dry. Ginger ale with a little bit of rye is really good. <laughs> um, but this one is really good. Just good, you know, zippy, fizzy ginger ale scent. Uh, the next one is grapefruit rosemary and just a plain white wax. And another scent that I love anything is grapefruit. I love smell it, eat it, drink it, lotion, you name it. I love grapefruit. Um, but this one... And I also love rosemary, and unfortunately, I'm not getting too much of either of those scents. Like, maybe a light citrus. I mean, it's still good, it's kind of a fresh scent, but it's not, I'm not getting an overly grapefruit scent, but it, but it is still good. All right, London Rain. Um, oh, by the way, um, I have 10 um, scents here, and then I also, purchase two destination bags and I'll probably do those in a separate video not to make it too long but anyway this so this uh this is I guess a duplicate oh no I think I pulled this out of my destination bag anyway uh it's L London Rain light blue this one's really nice it's very fresh and clean and I like if after you clean your house this would be what I would melt after the, you know, clean and you scrub and clean and there's no dust around and I really like this one. It's just a very, if you like fresh, clean scents, you will like this for sure. It's really nice. Oh, I, I did, like a grown up girl did, a warm rainy day in a London park, early morning dew, steady afternoon shower and a finally final downpour at dusk. Whatever. Okay, blackberry musk. This one's really good too. You do get the musk, and uh, one of my favorite scents uh, to wear is uh, from the body shop. It's called White Musk. I've been wearing it for years and years and years. Love it, love it, love it. And I mean, this isn't like that, but you're definitely getting that undertone of musk and a little bit of the blackberry. That's really good. I enjoy that. Okay, next one is Mouge des Bois, and this is uh, Lily of the Valley. And oh my gosh, this just reminds me of something from my childhood. It's green, it's outdoorsy, it's a plant. I guess it's Lily of the Valley, but this just really reminds me of something. It's really good, really, really good. It's a really outdoors, clean, not grass, and not, I mean, a teeny bit floral. It's not overly floral. It's just a, like a, a plant of some kind. Well, we know what the plant is. That's really good. I really like that. It just, it reminds me of something. We used to go camping every weekend, rain or shine when I was kids. Rain or shine, best memories ever. Um, and that just kind of reminds me of something about camping and being outdoors, something like that. Okay, moving on. This one is 221 Baker Street, uh, which I ordered because I love uh, Sherlock Holmes. And this, let me see what this one is. Sweet cherry pipe tobacco, vanilla, and soft leather. And I do get the cherry. You can definitely smell the cherry and the tobacco. This is really warm, warm, like rainy day scent. 
that's when I will be melting that. That's really good. Uh, French Lime Blossoms. Uh, that's a pretty green. And this is, again, it's just a really nice, very clean, slightly floral, not overly floral. I'm not big on florals, but I do enjoy this. It's just a very light floral. Uh, it says fresh spring floral, similar to uh, Jo Malone Fresh Lime Blossom. Mm, that's really good. They're all, I mean, they're all good. There's not a bad one in the bunch, honestly. They're all good. This one is Rose Water Lemonade. Pretty. And I'm getting more of the rose water and wax. I'm getting more of a rose fragrance than, than the lemon. Seems to be more lemon on the bottom. I don't know why. Maybe... Anyway, I, I'm getting a little bit more um, rose water than lemonade, but it's real. It's also a really good one. All right, uh, I'll leave that one. Apples and maple bourbon. Apples and maple bourbon. Pretty pink wax. This is very similar to the... Uh, Um, apple whiskey smash. I'm getting I'm I, I'm getting the kind of the same apple note and the same underlying deeper, richer note that I can't quite describe. What does it say? Apples, bourbon, vanilla, and maple syrup. Maybe it's the maple syrup that I'm smelling. Although it's not really mapley, I, I can't really say that. It's very very similar to the apple whiskey smash like a warm, a warm apple scent. Uh, black and black is black pepper and black vanilla. And I thought this sounded, sounded very intriguing. Why is that backwards? Hmm. Um, I, I, I thought this was really interesting. It's a teeny bit um, cologne-y, but, but not in a bad way, just very soft cologne and vanilla. And a little bit of something spicy, the pepper. That's a really good one as well. You know, like I said, they're all good. This one is Aberdeen. And it's a light green. And the notes are lavender, cedar, green herbs, and earth. And I bought this. And I will buy more of this because it's that good. Uh, because I'm a registered nurse. And the hospital I trained at way back in Guysboro, uh, not Guysboro, New Glasgow, Nova Scotia. The, the name of the hospital was the Aberdeen. That's where I trained a long time ago. And this is really good. This also is just a, a very green scent. Um, I, I, but it has a deeper undertone, not, nothing spicy, uh, not cologne just a, a deep green scent, like a warm green. It's warm green. I'm so bad at this, you guys. I'm just calling it, like my nose calls it, but that's really good, and I will. And there's several of these that I would repurchase. This, this is one of them. So that is my uh, first Destination Wax haul. I'm gonna come back, I'm gonna tape, um, tape, okay, that shows you my age. Record, um, the destination waxes and I will be back shortly. See you soon. Bye.